welcome to laravel 10 series and in this series we are going to start making the basic admin panel in laravel admin panel is required for any kind of website and recently i have added the poll in which i have asked that which website do you prefer to create in laravel 10 so the maximum votes have come for the e-commerce website you can see its vote is 57 percent see for any kind of website, even that is dating, news, e-commerce, discussion form, we require the basic admin panel. So we are going to first of all create the basic admin panel that can be required by any website that we are going to build in Laravel. We are talking about the dynamic website, not the static. Okay, so whether it is dating, news, e-commerce, forum, you require the basic admin panel. So the basic structure of the admin panel, uh, we must know the basic structure of the admin panel. I'm going to tell you straight away. Uh, see, this is the, uh, like, uh, this is your website. Okay. So here it comes the header. Uh, so I'm going to show you that this is the header part. Okay. And this is the middle content. Okay. Here middle content comes that vary from uh, page to page. Okay. This content varies from page to page and this part is the footer part okay and this is the footer part and this is the sidebar uh, where all the tabs uh, will come means uh, like products uh, uh, categories like this so this is the admin panel structure we are talking about the admin panel structure uh, that we are going to use in laravel okay so this is a kind of admin panel structure we can say admin panel as well as for the front uh, we are going to use this structure okay so uh, see we are going to uh, download the lte admin panel that is the famous admin panel that we are going to download and merge for our laravel 10 and after that we will uh, see that which website we are going to make but first of all we are going to create the basic admin panel so uh, let's quickly start so in this video we are going to install the laravel 10 and for laravel 10 uh, we need to make sure that we have installed the ZAMP, latest ZAMP as well as the composer. So I will briefly tell you that for installing the ZAMP, you must open the apachefriends.org website. I will just search the install ZAMP and here you can open this download ZAMP apachefriends.org website and here you can see you can download the latest version. If you are having the windows, you can go for this version. I want to tell you that for Laravel 10, we require at least php 8.1 okay so see keep this in your mind we require the php 8.1 version okay so this is mandatory version for laravel 10 so you need to make sure that you install this app that is having the uh, php 8.1 version at least okay so we will go for the latest version we will go for the php 8.2 and we have already downloaded the ZAMP. You can watch the video. You can check at your top right side the link I have given you. You can uh, see. Uh, you can able to set up in your system. Okay, ZAMP. You can download for the latest one. If you are having the Linux, you can go for this one, 8.2.0 version. And if you are having the Mac open system, then you must go for the latest one in this case as well. And that supports the eight uh, version, PHP 8.2 version. Okay, so go for the latest one for the Mac as well so after installing this one uh, so you must install the composer and i'm going to search here the install composer in google and uh, you must open the getcomposer.org website okay this is the website you must open and if you are uh, the windows then i have already created the separate video for installing the composer in windows you can check that video uh, see i have given that link at the top right side corner okay and for the mac as well i have the separate video for downloading the composer okay so you can easily download the composer so this is the second step uh, you must download it as per your operating system okay after downloading the composer then we are ready to install the laravel 10 and we are going to install the laravel 10 and for laravel 10 you can again open the website laravel.com and you can go to the documentation and uh, see here you can see installation you can scroll down you see you will automatically reach the laravel 10 version as it's launched few months back uh, see few days back okay 
so uh, now you can uh, scroll down and you can see there is the command okay we are going to copy this command and uh, you can go in your XAM folder once you have installed uh, you just need to run the XAM okay you can open uh, the XAM manager okay here in Mac we need to open it like this but if you are in Windows uh, you will straight away uh, get the folder you can go inside the folder and you can simply click on the XAM icon uh, where you will see the screen like this and you can simply run the MySQL database as well as the Apache server okay so I have already given you this demo in the previous videos you can watch those videos okay so I am going to copy this command that we are going to run for installing the Laravel 10 so I am going to run in my htdocs folder here right click new terminal folder and will paste and see I'm going to use here uh, 10 point star like this I'm using this because I want to install the Laravel 10 version uh, you must know that which version you are going to install you are going to install the Laravel 10 version okay if you want to install the Laravel 9 version you will simply do it like this okay when the Laravel 11 version come we can do it like this okay now we want to install the Laravel 10 so you can give this command for installing the Laravel 10 okay so it will take few minutes uh, for installing the Laravel 10 after that we are going to check it once and then uh, we will start with the uh, template our uh, LTE template I, I want to show you that which template we are going to download for getting the admin panel LTE admin panel okay so this is the very famous template we have earlier also done the uh, so now we are going to now it's having the latest version even okay so here you can see open this website uh, first of all we are going to open this website admin LTE here you can see you can open this website admin lte.io okay in which you can click on download and after clicking on download you will reach uh, its Git, github page here you can see it's updated on uh, february 8 2022 recent update okay so you just require to click on uh, see source code zip folder you just require to click on this folder and it will take few seconds downloading this template okay so this is the latest template that we we will go for and also uh, see we will take its overview as well live preview we can click on live preview and you can see uh, that this is the template that we will use uh, for the admin panel for getting the admin panel in laravel 10 okay so uh, we can use any of the template earlier on we have used this dashboard but now we are going to use this this dashboard okay this one it's responsive as well you can check here in responsive it's really the good one okay that we are going to use and we can check it like this okay uh, we are going to give here I like iPhone SC okay uh, so I can also do it like this okay and now I will select like 12 Pro here I will give the 100% okay so see the responsive view it's really beautiful responsive perfect okay so we are going to use this template so now uh, see I'm going to check our download is done okay so I'm going to uh, inside uh, um, my folder uh, see I have given the name uh, example app. okay I'm going to rename it to laravel 10 okay so i will go inside uh, this example 10 i am going to rename it to laravel 10 now La sorry i will i will make it ecom 10 okay ecom 10 okay or admin 10 admin 10 is good one admin 10 okay for now okay so any name you can give you can also give the project 10 or laravel 10 anything you can give okay project 10 you can also give okay it's your choice okay so we can go inside cd project 10 okay so after going inside this one i'm going to run this php artisan sir and let's see uh, yeah it start running and i'm going to check it now straight away and see our laravel is now running and its version is 10.1.5 you can check its version okay 
I'm going to make it big enough and you can check it it's 10.1.5 uh, and uh, see our RAM version is PHP 8.2.1 okay so this is the home page of the Laravel 10 this is the new home page of the Laravel 10 not same as Laravel 9 it is different from Laravel 9 okay so in this next video uh, see we are going to use this LTE admin template okay we will start merging it we will start integrating it uh, to our Laravel website uh, so that we can able to make it dynamic okay we will do step by step so that you will understand everything so stay tuned for the next video and i want to tell you once again see any kind of website that you are going to make in laravel you require this admin panel basic admin panel so this video is must this series is must for every laravel developer who just begin with the laravel or even the expert because we are going to do in a new way every time we will uh, we do something new okay so it's always good if you are going to watch okay so that's all for now have a nice time goodbye